So we're here at Eurobike 2018 with Alex from Reynolds. Alex, what's new? So I was asked to tell you about the new TR line. So it's our entry-level mountain bike wheels. TR stands for trail rated. We got the trail rated wheel line and go. Basically, all the nomenclature comes to the first two digits give you an indication of the inner width, and the 29 stands in the nine. That's what the numbers are for. So 29 we got inch. 29 inch. We got a 249. We got a TR 307. Seven stands for 27 and a half. Again, 30 mil inner channel. We got a 309. You guess what the naming is for? So that's a 30 mil internal for a 29 a wheel. Correct. And then there's the 367, which is more going for the plus. And it's a 36 inner with a 27 and a half. Diameter. Let's have a look at the wheels, which is a good example. Let's take a so, take this one. So they do feature a carbon rim, of course. We use um, Sapim sprint spokes and a 10 degree engagement hub. And on this model, it's a Reynolds hub. It's a Reynolds hub, correct? It's all straight pull. It's our center lock, which does come, of course, in the package. There is a six bolt adapter in. As always, it's tubeless hookless. It does come with the tubeless tape green start and it also has the tubeless valve in the package. And can you tell us a bit about the carbon technology? Not too much. <laughs> top secret. It's top but, secret. But it's a secret ingredient. That's the love. Yeah. But the, the, the layup is a trickle down from from the technology that's been used successfully on the World Cup downhill with the pivot team and Bernard Kerr basically, has been a key basically. development rider for you for some years, yeah? Yes, it is. It is, basically it is, but the uh, technology that we use in the downhill wheel is uh, the most sophisticated one that we have in the mountain bikes. It's called the IDM, Impact Dispersion Matrix. It's a little bit of a weaker carbon, but it actually takes impacts way better than uh, this one would. And with the mountain bike wheel line, does the same uh, warranty program apply? Exactly. It's a lifetime warranty. It's no rider weight limit, like with all our products. So just going back to the range for a second, um, so we've got the TR40, do, does, what changes between the different models apart from the rim, uh, the spokes and everything is the same within the TR range? Exactly. The spokes are the same, engagement is the same, hub is the same, the only thing that changes is obviously the rim and therefore it's um, designated purpose or use. So we're looking into the 249 to be more like a cross country orientated. While the 36, uh, 307 and 309 are going for more enduro and trail riding, while the TR367 is really for the plus rider, wide trail rider, and somebody even for uh, small e-bikes, it must be suitable for use. And the price point now is is much lower than what we've seen before on the black exactly. label range. Yeah, or, yes, US price level is 12.99. Check out UpgradeBikes.co.uk for UK pricing. Thanks, Alex. So in addition to the TR range, Alex, we've got this wheel set range here. Just let's have a look. We've got some pretty colors on the rims. And we're looking at the TRS range. What's the difference? So uh, while the TR range is our entry level, the TRS is our mid-price level. So we are good, better, best pricing. It's just the, the best. Uh, the, the better one, <laughs> sorry. And uh, we utilize the same rim as we did in the TR price level. So it's the 249S, it's the 309, it's the 307, and of course the 367. So it's the same rim internals. Exactly. It's but the, the S is standing for? Speed, which means we utilize a five degree speed hub. So more engagement with a five degree exactly. hub engagement. Also we use a CX sprint spokes which are slightly overlaced and allow the wheel to give a little bit more lateral flex. So it's a little bit more an agile wheel than we would have in the entry level version. And also in the package it does come out of the box with those grayish white decals. Now that's the standard out the box wheel as you get it with exactly. the uh, black and white look and then in the box it does come with a sticker set of five different colors so we got this turquoise the light blue orange the yellow 
and of course red. And all options included in the price. Exactly. So if the TRS range is your better, TR being good, this being better, what's the best? All black label. Black label is a designated purposefully designed wheel that we have and I would like to show you that as well, what's new on that side. So here we are with the the best in the MTB wheel sets from Reynolds and this is the black label offering. What have we got Alex? So what's uh, the new addition to the line besides what you already know, it's the white trail. The white trail has a 34 inner it's available in 29 and 27 and a half. If it's 27 and a half, it will be 347, obviously. And what's special about it, or the, the whole black, uh, black label line, it's our Industry 9 internals with three degrees of engagement. So it's the very finest engagement on the US made Torch Industry 9 standard hub. Exactly. For the quickest pickup fastest engagement, most efficient pedaling. Yep, not only that, but also it's the most high quality manufactured hub there is. It has everything of the internals EDM wire cut, not CNC. CNC always uh, leaves some swirling marks. You don't have that here. You have a total flat cutting surface, so there's no friction points where they don't need to be some. And that's obviously available in both uh, XD driver and Shimano? XD driver, of course, Shimano SRAM. And cool. And one graphic, one look, a stealthy black look as we've seen before. Yeah. It's a painted rim, asymmetrical build as you know from us. And it's then paired with a very nice stripy design of a water slide decal. So that's the Wide Trail 349 black label. And then we have the XC259 black label. This is coming in at 1380 grams of wheel set. So this is your cross country racer's dream, right? It is, it is. If I would be cross country racer, I would actually, that would be my wet dream. <laughs> and you have some interesting graphics on this as well. Yeah. Beautiful. It looks, okay. like, it looks like uh, a dry, dry ground that has broken up. So Reynolds wheels back with abundance of good, better, best carbon wheels for mountain bike. Truly the carbon wheel experts. Alex, thank you very much. Thank you too. So it's time to look at Eurobike 18 at some of the aero wheels from Reynolds. Alex from Reynolds is here to take us through the new black label aero wheel range. Yeah, so since we are changing our, our pricing approach, as you've seen in the mountain biking, we're also actually lifting up our aero line to become also in line with the black label, not only in pricing, but also in naming. So you already know the aero 46 disc brake. You all know the Aero 65 disc brake, also available in rim brake. But what's all new now, we also offer an Aero 80 disc brake. So far it was only available as rim brake, but now it's the latest addition to our Aero line and it's perfectly aerodynamically shaped as all of our Aero products. So this is using the DET rim profile, deep section. It's a little hard to see in the light here. Yeah. But CX, the addition CX race of spokes. CX race spokes and the hub. Industry 9, of course. So the top level hub as well. Yeah. 20 spokes in the front, 24 in the back. And of course with our well-known Industry 9 60-degree engagement internal with the torch hub. So on the Aero line wheel set it's a 6-degree. It's on the MTB it's a 3-degree on the degree. MTB and 6-degree on the hub. Okay. And these are available now? Yep, they're available now. Tubeless, clincher as we know them, 90 millimeter inner channel. And 46, 65 and 80 rim depths. And freaking fast. 